Hi everyone and welcome back to our channel Salesforce FAQs and here on this channel we simplify Salesforce for admin and developers. So today we are going to tackle a task that many of us encounter that is that is mass deleting records in Salesforce. So whether you are cleaning up data or fixing errors, knowing how to safely and efficiently delete records in bulk is very crucial. So let's get started. So first I would like to explain what is the term mass deletion in Salesforce. So mass deletion of records in Salesforce refers to the process of removing multiple records from Salesforce database. So now in this video we are going to discuss the two methods through which we can uh, mass delete the records or you can say delete multiple records in Salesforce. So the first method to delete the records is using the inbuilt mass delete record tool and the second method to delete the records in bulk is using the Salesforce data loader tool. And for the second method you need to install the data loader tool in your system install and if you haven't installed it then i will also give a video link in the description from where you can see how you can download the data loader in your windows system so let's get started and see the first method where we will delete the bulk records using the inbuilt mass delete record tool so as of now i have logged into my salesforce org and right now i am on the setup page of salesforce lightning and from here we will navigate to the tool that is that is mass delete records so for that you have to go to the quick find box and here search and select mass delete records so under the heading data select mass delete records so here in the mass delete records you can see the options so from the tool mass delete records we can delete accounts leads activities contacts cases solution products and reports so we can say this tool is limited to few objects like we cannot delete the opportunity records from this tool. So here I will show you how you can mass delete the records from the objects that are available in this tool. So for example let's take leads and for that we have to click on the option mass delete leads. So here you can see the setup of mass delete leads so and here you can see the step 1, 2 and 3. So these are the instructions that we have to follow for deleting mass records from the from mass delete records setup and in the step 3 we have to match the criteria to delete the records that means we can apply the filters for example we want to delete only those lead records having lead source as web so for that we can apply filters here so for that we will select lead source and then equals to and here we will enter the value of lead source that is web and after this we will click on the search button so according to the applied filters it will retrieve the records so you can see these are the records according to the applied filter so it have returned only those leads having the lead source as web so from here on the checkboxes on the left hand side we can select uh, multiple records or if you click on the first one it will select all the records so let me show you how it works so i will select these two leads and after this we will click on the delete button and now i will again scroll to the section and as you can see the leads that you have deleted right now are removed from the list so this is how you can delete multiple records using the mass delete record tools in salesforce and now we will move ahead and see the process of deleting records in bulk using the salesforce data loader tool so as of now i opened the data loader tool that you can see on the screen and there are the different button for different data operation that is insert update absurd delete undelete export and export all so here we are going to mass delete the records and for that we need to create a csv file and in that csv file we need the id of the records so to get the id of the records that we are going to delete first we will run an export operation uh, through which we will extract the data of the records including the id field and after that we will use the same data to delete those records so first we will export the records using the export operation for that i will click on the export button and here it will ask me for the login so i will log in with my credentials so here in the second step we have to select the object for which we are going to delete the records in bulk so in this example i am going to delete the opportunity object because because in the mass delete records tool you won't see the opportunity there is no option to delete the opportunity records so in this example i am going to delete opportunity records so for that i will search and select opportunity this is so here i have selected the opportunity object 
and after this we have to select the location for the csv file and after selecting the object and the location for the csv file click on the next button now we have to select the query fields that is the information of the fields that we want to export so the most important information that we need for the records is the record id so first i will search and select record id that is id of the record and after this you can select the other query fields like name like name in opportunity stage so i will select those query fields also that is name in stage name and after selecting the query fields i will click on the finish button and at last click yes to proceed so here we can see we have 88 successful extraction so first we will click on the button view extraction and now you can see the extracted records in the csv viewer of the data loader so in the id columns you can see the ids of the records and with the name we can figure out which records we have to delete so to get this data into a csv file we have to click on the button open in the external program so as you can see we have extracted the data in the csv file and in your system you will see this file on the location that you have selected while extracting the data that is on the second step where we have selected the opportunity object and the file location so in this csv file you have to keep the data of the records that you want to delete so as of now i have sorted the records and in this csv file i have kept only those records that i want to delete and after making the changes we will save this csv file and then we will go back to the data loader so first i will close the data operation from the previous data extract and now to mass delete the records we will click on the delete button and in this step we have to select the object for which we are going to delete the records so we are going to delete the records of opportunity object so we will select the object as opportunity and now we have to select the csv file so this csv file will be the file that we have created right now by extracting the data of the opportunity records so now i will browse the csv file from the location and after selecting the csv file we have to click on the next button so as you can see the data loader will initialize the csv file that we have uploaded and it will show you the number of rows of the records and the and also the batch size so here click on the ok button to proceed and in the third step we have to do the mapping of the records from the uh, object field columns to the csv file header columns for that click on the button create or edit a map and in the mapping dialog window you have to click on the button auto match field to the columns so when you delete the records you have to only map the id so here we will click on the ok button in the mapping dialog window and here click on the next button so in this step 4 you have to select the location for the error and success file that in case if any error occurs so at last click on the finish button and as you click on the finish button you will see a warning message that you have chosen the delete existing records so here click yes to proceed and here press yes again so as you can see the data operation is started and after completing the mass delete operation we, we can see we have nine successful deletes and zero errors that means we have successfully deleted the records so for that we will click on the button view successes and here in the csv viewer of the data loader you can see the status so the status is showing that the item is deleted so in this way you can mass delete the records in salesforce using the salesforce data loader tool so let's take a recap of deleting records through the data loader that first we will create a csv file and i've also shown you the method that that it is better to export the data through the data loader only and after it and after that you can make some changes like keeping or removing the records then you can use the same csv file to delete the records so this is how you can delete bulk records in salesforce using the tools like mass delete records and salesforce data loader tool so i hope that you have understood whatever i have explained in the video so if you have liked this video then please do like share and subscribe and do not forget to hit the bell icon so that every time we upload a new video you will get a notification regarding that and thank you for giving your time and watching this video till last see you in the next video till then goodbye